On the four-wheel Kadjar, a switch on the central console offers a choice of three transmission modes to suit the driver's needs. The selected mode is displayed on the instrument panel. Two-wheel drive mode is selected by turning the selector to the 2WD position. The 2WD indicator light illuminates on the instrument panel. 2WD mode uses only the front wheels for driving in good conditions and to optimize fuel consumption. To exit 2WD mode, the driver turns the selector to Auto. Auto mode automatically distributes the engine torque between the front and rear axles based on traction conditions and vehicle speed. It ensures the best compromise between fuel consumption, drive force and road holding. It is adapted to any type of road, especially where traction varies. In auto mode, the vehicle operates in traction mode, but automatically switches to 4x4 when traction deteriorates. Four-wheel drive mode is selected by turning the switch to the lock position. The switch then returns to its initial position. The 4WD lock indicator lights up on the instrument panel and the torque is distributed 50-50 between the front and rear wheels. This mode is recommended in poor traction conditions such as in snow, mud, earth and sand and at low speed. When driving on loose ground in lock mode, deactivating ESC via the button on the lower left-hand side of the dashboard is recommended. Only the wheel-by-wheel -wheel braking function remains active and will brake the wheel or wheels that are slipping and transfer the engine torque to the wheels with the most traction. Four-wheel drive mode is deactivated by turning the selector back to the lock position. In lock mode, the four-wheel drive reverts to auto mode when the vehicle exceeds 25 miles per hour or 40 kilometers per hour. If there is a fault in the four-wheel drive system, the vehicle defaults to 2WD mode.